as you may have heard, four part harmony. It's supposed to be only four parts. So what makes a good barbershop song? Well, first of all, you, you need a, a melody that's easily sung, easily remembered. And uh, here's an example of a part of part of the sound. So then we need a, a, a part under that, the bass. So the bass, for those who understand musical chords, sings mostly the, the roots and the fifths of the chord. So the, the bass part sounds like and together they sound like So the thing that makes Barbershop different is that you have a high harmony part. So normally when a, 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 a church choir sings, the melody is in the highest part. Not so in Barbershop, it's a second voice down. So in Barbershop you should always hear a harmony part above the lead. And this is what we call the tenor, and this is how it sounds. Together they sound like my wild Irish rose, love sweet as far that grows. We're nearly there, but there's one magic ingredient, one magic part, which is the baritone part, and that sounds like <coughs> my wild.